On the eve of the 50th annual Munich Security Conference, students and young leaders from across Germany were invited to participate in their own discussion about the transatlantic relationship at an event called MSC 50 Unplugged, gearing up for the transatlantic renaissance. Participants engaged in a vigorous debate from the same room where heads of state and defense and foreign ministers from around the world gather annually to discuss the most pressing global issues. We asked them what the transatlantic relationship means to them, and here's what they said. The transatlantic relationship is one or the most important international partnership in, in today's international relations because it's rooted deep in, in values as well as in interests. And the common values is, I think, what makes it so strong. Transatlantic relationship to me is important. I have many friends in the US. I lived there for a couple of months and I think culturally we're very together. I watch The Daily Show and everything. I like the TV series. But on the other hand, of course, it's difficult uh, on the political stage to keep up with all the stuff that's been going on. And you hear some negative things and you don't know if it's right or not because I think it lacks transparency a lot of times. I spend a year abroad so since my friends over there are very important to me and I have a very special connection to them it's very important to me for Germany to have a good connection and good relationship with America. There's a strong interdependence also on the German side as an exploitation. Um, we cannot really afford to cut down our relations with America because we need a strong economic partner. Um, I think we have to um, be better at it as we are now because um, with the NSA problems and all those things that came up recently, um, the relations are getting worse and worse and in my opinion um, I think America is a great partner to um, to work with. I'm really interested in the um, transatlantic partnership and I think it's still very important for Europe and for the US as well. I mean there are two very big markets, they're very important, but I also think that there are some constraints. I mean the uh, partnership uh, which is just being discussed to um, further um, the um, you have a single market with the United States um, will bring added benefit, but it's also um, difficult because um, there are very different um, rules and regulations, and, I, and I'm interested in that perspective and how um, the U.S. and Europe will overcome these problems.